everyone. Today I'm here to discuss a topic from dental materials. This is a term that is normally used for dental materials and sometimes for the construction materials as well. Thermoplastic materials. Now as the name indicates, thermo, something to do with the heat and plastic. Plastic means they are moldable. So, if we go to the definition, so materials that are hard otherwise, but become soft, flexible and moldable on application of heat. Now this is very clear. And the examples include from the dental materials of these days, cut aperture, the DP points that are used to fill the root canals, in the process of RCT, that is root canal treatment. Dental waxes that uh, include the wax sheets and beading wax, the impression compound, including the green stick and crumpet cake, zinc oxide region or impression paste. Now, to understand the concept of thermoplastic materials in a better way, if we take an example of dental waxes. Now, if you pick up a wax sheet in the normal room temperature, you just hold it and you try to mold it or you try to bend it, it's going to break because it's very brittle. But if you take it to the flame of the Bunsen burner, and then you heat it a bit, then, before it's melting point definitely, then it becomes very soft and moldable. Then you can use it for the purpose of making the rims or whatever purpose you're using it for. The rims, the wax sheet rims are used to take the gelation shape. So, for any of the purpose, for the main uh, thing to talk about is that they become moldable on the application of heat. So this is the sole meaning of the term thermoplastic. That the plasticity of a material is increased or enhanced whenever heat is applied. Thank you.